Hello, today's video is a guide to the Fossil Island prayer training method. If you don't know, this involves the mycelium pool on Fossil Island and later the strange machine in the house on the hill. The only requirements for this method are having completed the quest of Bone Voyage for access to Fossil Island. And you need unidentified fossils, though identified work the same as long as they're not plant fossils. So it's better to keep them unidentified to save time you'd spend cleaning them, and so that you don't get plant fossils and then you're unable to use them. You also need calcite and pyrophosphite, 10 of each per inventory, so I bought a lot to see how many I'll use up. There are many different ways to get calcite, pyrophosphite, and fossils, but the first two you can just buy off the GE if you're not an Iron Man. Fossils are the ones you have to worry about because they're not extremely easy to get. I have some fossils in my bank that I've saved up. I recommend having graceful or weight reducing armor because you do run a bit, but you can restore your run between trips so it's not really a big deal. And some kind of teleport to Fossil Island and a teleport to a bank unless you're using the fossil storage. I'm just using my construction cape for the house teleport. It's good to have as many inventory spots as possible for your fossils. The mycelium pool is located northeast of the meadow mush tree. Here you fill the hopper with fossils, which you can store up to 28 at a time. And 10 pyrophosphite and calcite. It doesn't matter which you do first, but it's faster to spam click it. Then you wait, and bobbing fossils will start appearing in the pool. You have to pop these so that you don't lose these fossils. It's good to run back to the middle after popping one so you can get to the other side quicker if one shows up on the other side. When it's done, you open the gate to the north. and collect your enriched bones. Then go back to the house on the hill. Use an enriched bone on this strange machine and you can just AFK for a bit. Teleport to a bank and repeat. I was going to do this method for an hour, but 30 minutes in, I realized I probably wasn't going to have enough fossils for a full hour, so I just stopped halfway. I used up all 212 of my small fossils, and 22 medium fossils, so a total of 234 fossils in 30 minutes. So for a full hour, I'd need about 468. I used 90 calcite and pyrophosphite, so in an hour that'd be 180. So in 30 minutes, I used 7k GP on this method. In an hour, I would have used 14k. Buying this stuff on the GE isn't easy though, you'll probably have to wait a while to buy them at the normal price. But it's still pretty cheap for a decent prayer method. Different sized fossils give different XP. Small gives 500. Medium gives 1000, large gives 1500, and rare gives 2500. So doing 468 small fossils in an hour would be 234k XP per hour. Medium would be 468k, large would be 702k, and rare would be over 1 million. I only have 29 rare fossils though, and I've done a lot of stuff on Fossil Island. At least if you're AFKing ammonite crabs or doing herbivore, you'll get a bunch of fossils over time. Here's the XP I got in my 30 minutes. I did mostly small fossils but ran out at the end and did some mediums. Overall, it's a great method, although not sustainable in the long run. It'd be pretty difficult to get enough fossils for a lot of XP. But at least now you know what to do with your spare fossils when you're done with the museum or if you have a lot of fossils and need some prayer levels. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed or found this guide useful. Goodbye, lovely people.